I know it's summertime, but these boys are eating me out of house and home, y'all. Work it, bake it, do it, makes us harder, better, faster, stronger. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. My name is Nicole. If you are new, thanks so much for stopping by. I have a weekly grocery haul, low carb, anabolic, keto friendly items, all the things. We went to Sam's Club and did a pickup. We also went to Walmart, went in store, and then we got some hot BOGO deals from Winn-Dixie that I definitely want to share with you guys. Super killer, but I feel like I'm at the grocery store every single day. I buy something, I look over, it's gone. And I say boys, that includes the hubby as well. It's summertime. Time. I feel like the appetites are through the roof. Let me take it down to the counter and show you what we got from all the stores. Sam's Club in-store $99 haul. What did we get this week? I needed some bananas. So went ahead and got them there. Their avocados were a great price. And how many do you get in there? Five in there. And I love them because they're huge. They're ready to go. But if you put them in the crisper, that's the hack I tell you guys. They last forever and they are perfection. Under $4 for five. That was cheaper than Walmart. Got our favorite bread, which is the Nature's Own Honey Life Wheat Club Pack. It's the keto friendly bread. It's 40 calories a slice. I tell you guys all the time, I don't think it's keto friendly because it's seven net carbs a slice, but it's definitely great for cutting and great for low carb anabolic lifestyle. The boys loved the grapes we've been getting from Imperfect, but they've been out. So Waylon actually requested some grapes. So I picked up a big package. This is three pounds and it's like such a great price over there. That was killer. I'm switching from eating a bunch of strawberries this week on the meal plan to raspberries. Just switching it up because we've been getting strawberry wasted. And this was a great price for the two pack Driscoll's one. So I picked up two of them. However, I will say a lot of them look sad. I had to dig for some good ones because a lot of them were like, had mold on them are like were mushed up so make sure you check i love the english cucumbers over at sam's so i got these versus just regular i feel like the regular goes bad quicker and they get mushy real quick these stay crisp nice and long and that's how i like them for my salads that i do for the week now this is something that you guys recommended to me this is the kinder's rub seasonings when i hauled the ones over here so i hauled these popcorn seasonings last week y'all told me to look for these because you said they taste even better and they were so cheap one of these this one is on rollback right now at sam's club it's on an instant savings and the little ones at walmart were the same price basically as these big eight ounce and nine and a half ounce ones so i got the buttery steakhouse one y'all said this one is a must on everything but if you're looking for a buttery taste you said this one's fire so i can't wait to try it and then the garlic and herb look good too and then when we go to walmart there is a burger butter one that i want to try that they didn't have at sam so i picked these two up y'all let me know if you've tried these and what you like to put them on like veggies meats all the things the boys love the oikos triple zero blended greek yogurts you get six strawberries six mixed berry and six vanilla in here 15 grams of protein they are sweetened with stevia and monk fruit this is good when cutting as well if you want to incorporate this in your cutting diet really recommend they are out of stock all the time. Happy to see it. So I snagged one. Something that I've been loving is the Canadian bacon by Jones Dairy Farm. This is a great price over at Sam's versus Walmart. And the macros on it are crazy for cutting. So for three slices, it's 60 calories, one and a half fat, and 10 protein. I mean, you cannot beat that at all. It's really comparable to your turkey bacon. So if you don't like turkey bacon and you're looking for a switch, switch over to this. They sell it at Walmart and Sam's, probably at Costco too, which by the way, y'all let me know. I'm thinking about going back to Costco for a couple of things and getting a membership, but let me know what products you've been getting for anabolic, low carb, and what's worth it over at Costco before I bite the bullet. I needed some Quest chips for a recipe this week. Um, we are doing nachos and we're going to use the Quest chips as our chip source. And instead of paying like $3 a bag singly at Walmart, they have these for less than $10 and I get more bang for my buck. So the actual, the ranch is less fat than the nacho cheese by a significant amount, but the calories are the same and the protein's the same. So if you're looking for something with a little less fat, choose the blue package over the nacho cheese. This is something that I just discovered over at Winn-Dixie. If you watch me on Instagram, I did a whole Winn-Dixie haul and they had these buy one, get one free. I've tried the coffee cake ones and they are fire on a peach cobbler protein ice cream. I'm going to be sharing with you guys here on the channel. This 
week probably. It is so good. They don't sell the coffee cake ones. They only sell the chocolate fudge brownie at Sam's, but you get 40 in here, I think for $10. That's crazy because they're really expensive at Walmart and at Winn-Dixie. And I have plans in mind for this for something for myself too. And the boys can eat these. They're five net carbs, 70 calories, and they aren't really high in protein, but everything else is spot on. So if you're looking for a good weight loss, like sweet option, there you go right there. And that's the day before the 4th of July. So I got the mini cinnamon rolls for the boys to eat. You just warm them up and serve and they love cinnamon rolls. So I thought I would treat them for the 4th morning. And y'all saw me haul the one of these from Target. It was a good deal. And I'm in love with it. So I'm using it for my dishes. I'm using it to spray down the shower. It works really great for that with the glass and everything. If you need something to get all like that soap scum off, this is working great. The Dawn Triple Pack Power Wash. And this is a really good price over there at Sam's versus buying it singly at Walmart or at Target. So I'm almost halfway done with the one that I bought. So I went ahead and got another one because I'm using it for all the things. So this is everything we got at our Sam's Club for our weekly Sam's Club trip. We will be going to the Wally World. If you've been following me on Instagram, you know that I have been going to Winn-Dixie and taking advantage of their buy one, get one free deals have been fire this week. When you're watching, I think they are expired today. I don't know if they overlap like my Rouse's does. So definitely check and let me know in the comments below if it does. But they were killer. So we went for like the fourth or fifth time to Winn-Dixie to stock up on some things that we are currently loving. That was $30 and then $80 for an in-store Walmart haul. So at Walmart, we picked up the White American Cheese by Land O'Lakes. This is the pre-sliced ones that they put in the little um, cooler thing, which is nice. So I don't have to wait in line for that. And that is for Trey's Keto Queso. I did get something new. Okay, something new. This is definitely Dirty Keto Alert. These are the Keto Culture Baking Hamburger Buns. Now, these are expensive. $4.98 for these hamburger buns. However, they are super great for cutting and for weight loss. So they're only 50 calories for a bun. That's crazy. Two grams of fat. We've got one net carb and we've got six protein, which is flipping fantastic. However, the ingredients, we've got some questionable things down towards the bottom. So just FYI, making that out there, making that transparent. But I got these for probably next week. We're going to do burgers. I'm going to put these in the freezer. They are always sold out. They legit had three packs on the shelf when I went today. So being that I saw them, I snagged it because I can never get my hands on them. And I want to try them and see how they are. These are comparable probably to the Aldi ones and the ones from Costco. Y'all let me know if you've tried these before at your Walmart, but they are carrying them now. Got another package of the Happy Eggs. Y'all been asking me about the yolk situation. Apparently it's from the heat is what I'm reading, but the last couple of batches I've gotten have been fine. They've changed their packaging, which is super cute. And y'all know we love those. I got something new. So yes, I'm steering away from the, v the Velveeta. Don't come for me. And I know some people will probably come for me for this too, but these, in my opinion, are good. They don't have any of the canola oil and stuff like that that Velveeta does. So I got the Kraft Singles. This is the White American. And in this, there are 50 calories per slice three and a half grams of fat, three protein and two carb. There are the ingredients right there if you want to take a screenshot for the white American. And then we got the 2% American. And for these, they are a little bit less calorie, 45, two and a half fat for protein. And there are the ingredients right there for you. I also did pick up, that's not in this haul. If you follow me on Instagram, you saw it, the fat-free Borden singles at Win Dixie. So I'm going to give those a try too. Those have worse ingredients than these. These are better for you, just FYI. And in my opinion, not much fat. It's not going to make a, in calories. It's not going to be detrimental in your cutting weight loss journey. So we got two of these and I got the 24 packs because the 16 pack was almost the same price. It was crazy. So that is going to be our cheese of choice that we're going to try out on the boys are loving grilled cheese and stuff like that. Got the Greek cream cheese. This is the one that has four times the protein, half the fat. I'm loving this in recipes. That's great in Trace Keto Queso, a better option than regular cream cheese. Got another package of the Green Giant Extra Sweet Corn on the Cob. We're eating a ton of this this week. I went ahead and heated up and cooked some, but I need a couple of extra ones and I'm gonna put the rest in the freezer. I am loving these sliced bananas from Walmart. They are so easy to put in smoothies with the Quest peanut butter protein powder and have like a peanut butter banana shake. It is so good and so easy. The macros on this are pretty good too. So it's one cup is 80 calories. 
We've got 18 total carbs, two fiber, and less than one gram of protein, and it's just bananas. So if you're looking for some bananas that are already frozen, it's pretty cheap too. I'm gonna to be trying out today, actually, an anabolic chaffle. So it's like the chaffles we made on keto, but instead of real eggs, we're gonna use egg makers or egg whites. So I got the great value egg makers for that. To give that a try, can't wait to see if it comes out good. Hopefully we don't have a hot mess express on the little mini dash. Loving the Fairlife fat-free ultra-filtered milk. I'm using this and the boys' um, Kodiak cake pancakes instead of just regular milk or whatever. It's loaded with protein, really clean. And there was a 50 cent I bought a rebate, so that was a score. We are almost out. I picked up the two good yogurts for myself. So instead of getting the Faye zero percent, I'm opting for these because they're already flavored and it's a, it's close to the same amount of protein and it's less carbs and it is about the same calories. And I like this when I did keto, so why not? So I got three of the cherry, two of the vanilla, and two of the blueberry. Those are my favorites of the two good. Waylon is out of his dinosaur chicken nuggets and he did like the veggie ones from Target, just FYI. But while we're at Walmart, they do sell the same brand, the gluten-free ones, but they don't sell the veggie ones. And this is a bigger box and it's cheaper at Walmart. So I opted to get that for him until we can get back to Target to get the veggie ones. Something brand new, y'all let me know in the comments down below if you've tried this before. The Green Giant Veggie Hash Browns Cauliflower. I was impressed by the macro. So for two hash browns, it's 140 calories, eight grams of fat. You've got 10 net carbs and five protein. Now, yeah, we've got a couple of questionable ingredients down there in the Green Giant line, the veggie tots and stuff like that are but it's better than the original. So you gotta pick your battles, right? And I thought that would be really good to go along with some like eggs and some turkey bacon for a quick anabolic yummy breakfast for a weekend. I needed two of the chicken of the sea premium ahi yellowfin tuna cups. Y'all know I love those. I just dump this on top of a salad instead of having to cook your protein source. It's done super clean for any lifestyle as far as macros go, incredible. So definitely check that out, Walmart. They have some other ones, but the other ones are kind of questionable. Now the boys needed some more peanut butter and this is the one that I always get because it's super good and super clean. The Crazy Richards 100% peanuts. It is just peanuts, that's it. When you're looking for peanut butter, you just want peanuts and salt. You don't want palm oil, sugar, and even though I am eating some other things questionable, guys, that's one thing I will not go and revert back to is like regular Jif, that all the way. Got a couple of water enhancers for myself. And uh, If y'all watched this week's vlog that I posted on Monday, I had a hot mess express with the hack with the Sonic drink. So I'm gonna try this Kool-Aid cherry and see if it's better. So that's for me, not for the boys. Also for me is the great value, the Simply. This is the only flavor I've seen in the Simply. So it's clear, which means they don't have like the red number 40 and all the added dyes, which is nice. So the boys could use this too if I wanted to. And it's a strawberry watermelon just to have on hand to enhance my water when I get done with my first half gallon. Got some more seasonings. I told you guys I was gonna get this Kinder's Buttery Burger Blend. It looks so good. There are the ingredients, there are the macros for you, but I can't wait to try that on burgers next week with the burgers, buns, and see how that all is. I got some more of the popcorn seasonings. I told you guys I was. The ranch, sour cream and onion, they still have like three or four more flavors. It's incredible how many flavors they have of this stuff, but I love sprinkling this on the corn on the cob or on my broccoli. It was fire, and that is great for cutting low carb weight loss journey. That's a little hack there. Last two things I got at Walmart were some non-food items. I got some spoons. I'm just loving having that versus durying up a bunch of stuff while everybody's here for summer. And this is always the best deal over at Walmart is the double zipper bags and the gallon. You get 40 in here for less than $3. Cheaper than Sam, so always get them there. So that was everything we got at Walmart for $80. Over here at Winn-Dixie with all of our BOGO deals, we spent $30. Can you believe that? $30 for all this. It's crazy. So the boys, I hauled these a couple of days ago and they flew through the goldfish already. And Waylon was like so over the moon with the Avengers and the superhero ones. He just had like the time of his life eating these, I swear. And these were buy one, get one. So they were two for $2.49. I thought that was a really good deal. And they also really loved this cheesy white cheddar. This is new. I like this one versus the yellow one because it doesn't make such a mess on their hands, but they still get the cheddar flavor, if you know what I mean. So that was good. So I stocked up on those.
stocked up on these for myself. I use these in my peach cobbler protein ice cream recipe that you guys will see tomorrow. So make sure your notifications are clicked for that. If you're looking for a new flavor of protein ice cream, peach is great for the summer. And this topping right here, it just makes that cobbler so, so good. These were two for $4.79 because they were BOGO. So I went ahead and stocked up. When Dixie's the only place I have found the cinnamon coffee cake flavor. Y'all saw me haul the brownie went at Sam's Club, which was a much better deal. Now I've been getting wasted on the fat-free cheddar cheese. They also have the mozzarella. This is such a hot deal, guys. These are two for $4.49, and then you got 50 cents off each bag with Ibotta. So that is crazy, like $2 a bag. Y'all know how expensive these are at Walmart, even the great value brand. So I got four bags, and then I got um, $2 back from Ibotta. BOGO deal, hot deal. Daisy Light Sour Cream, we love this stuff. It was $2, so that was a good deal. Also, $2 was a diced red onion, so instead of getting an onion and dicing it myself, y'all know I hate doing that, I paid for the convenience and had it done, and I will freeze the rest of this and have that for later, so that is a win. I needed some shredded lettuce for our nachos for Tuesday, for Taco Tuesday, and these were a buy one, get one. I was shocked, so I got two for $1.99, so a dollar a bag was cheaper than the great value over at Walmart. These Enlighten Light Bars, the sea salt caramel, they are my new addiction. They are 80 calories, so delicious. It's like ice cream in a bar, one and a half fat, seven grams of protein. You've got 16 total carbs, five fiber, and six sugar alcohols. They are delicious and they're pricey though. So on sale, $4. I know. The boys are loving hot dogs. Trey is eating hot dogs now. Can y'all believe it guys? He's come such a long way with his sensory and with eating and I'm here for it. And these hot dog buns were on sale for BOGO. So it made two of them $3.59 for both, which I thought was really good. And if you are cutting and if you're weight loss and you're looking for a burger or a hot dog bun, this is one of the lowest calorie ones I've found. So 130 for calories and you've got one and a half fat, four protein and 24 net carbs for a bun. So carby, but if you were doing low carb, it definitely fits in the macros. That's everything we got for $30 for the BOGO deals from Winn-Dixie and from Walmart. We do have an Imperfect Foods order coming with some proteins and some produce, but they always come late. So make sure to follow me on Instagram so you can see exactly what we got over at Imperfect and look down below because you can always get $20 off your first order with them. That's with this that week's link. grocery haul, y'all. Please give it a huge thumbs up if you look forward to these weekly grocery hauls here on my channel. And if you are new, and just stopping by. I would love to have you a part of the family. So make sure to smash that subscribe button down below. Make sure that bell's clicked so you get notified every time I upload a new grocery haul here on the channel. Don't forget Imperfect Foods is $20 off. I know some of you guys use the link and I think it gave you like $50 off a couple weeks ago. So definitely check. You never know with that link and you can get a lot of stuff with $20 from Imperfect Foods. Love their produce. Love the service. They've just been coming late so that's why you're not seeing it. But again, follow me on Instagram so you can see everything in real time. Thank y'all so much for watching. I hope you have an amazing day. I hope you have an awesome week. I hope this video was helpful in helping you pick out certain foods for your weight loss journey. And we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye y'all.